And welcome everybody to the Big Poly Video Channel. I am Paul Blom here in Pinellas Park, Florida on 5 o'clock Friday, April 15th, tax day. And there is big news uh, happening this afternoon. The United States Department of Justice is going after three online poker sites, Poker Stars, Full Tilt Poker, and Absolute Poker. I find it very interesting that now they go after online poker uh, saying it is illegal and the people in, involved were engaged in money laundering and all that kind of business. Uh, when online poker has been around at least 10 years, kind of led to the online poker boom. Uh, for those of you who follow the World Series of Poker, it really caught on fire in 2003 when Chris Moneymaker, who spent $40 on poker stars, he was an accountant out of Nashville, Tennessee, if I remember correctly, won the World Series uh, which was then worth two and a half million to the winner, outlasting a professional named Sam Farha. I just find it interesting this happens all these years later, and it's all these years later that the United States has decreed from on high that these uh, these online poker sites are illegal. Um, it just happens to coincide with the fact that if you watch the news and the, the news on websites, you'll know that the United States government is going after the internet. Uh, it's that Jay Rockefeller gave a speech a year or two ago basically saying it was too free. And uh, all of a sudden, like I was saying in my blog entry on Mon uh, Tuesday, it was Tuesday, I did one Monday, but I didn't talk about this, that, that they're kind of inching a little bit here and a little bit there to, to the point where they control it all. And a few years ago, you would think this was a conspiracy theory. Well, now it's turning into a conspiracy fact. And if uh, what happened today to all these people who had money in online poker accounts doesn't wake you up to that fact, what will? Um, just for full disclosure, I played in some online poker tournaments in uh, 2010. Uh, I played in the, in a blogging championship of online poker on Poker Stars, and I won a, a ticket to one of the uh, spring championship of online poker events called Scoop, and I won a, a couple few hundred dollars. And one of my first thoughts back then was, I better cash out uh, because you do, I don't know how long this online poker thing is going to last. Well, if you had if you had money in an online poker account today it has been seized it has been seized if you have a uh, in poker stars they're not allowing people to play for money anymore in the united states and i think they have done similar without knowing at this point at 505 p.m eastern time i don't know if they've done the same thing at full tilt or absolute poker but if they have it's a logical development so once again, the government is trying to score points and saying online poker is illegal and those of you who play on online poker are terrorists. Well, I say nuts to that. Okay, this has been my blog entry the 15th of April 2011. If you haven't paid your taxes, you might want to think about it. Okay, bye-bye for now.